channel or welcome if you are new here. This is one of my most favorite videos to do. Yes, it is another unboxing from Your Creative Studio. This is the June box. Only thing I've done is cut the tape. I've not even peeked. Even though I've wanted to, I've had it like two or three days. I've really wanted to look, but I've been so good. So good, but not anymore. It's time to get into it. Yes. So as always, y'all, this is like, I say it every unboxing that I do for your creative studio. This is like Christmas. I love to open these. These are the best subscription boxes that you can possibly get. If you have not already subscribed, make sure you head over to their website and sign up. Get you one, two, three, four. I don't know. Get as many of these boxes as you can get. You will not be sorry. So as always, the little business card that she puts in here is a good indicator of what's in the box. And I see some pinks and purples and blue hydrangeas. And it says, thank you so much for your purchase. I hope you would enjoy this selection, your creative studio. And these are great to put in journals and look. So I'm excited because that is a good indicator of what is in here. Now, is this different than the last ones? That label looks a little different to me. It may not be, but it looks a little different. I'm going to set this stuff out so I can move the box. And guys, I finally, the other day, I just combined all of my, because y'all know I've normally have kept all of my stuff from your creative studio. I've kept it in the boxes on shelves. And every now and then, I will just go and look through it because I just, I love, I love it. But I finally, I was like, no, you got to use this stuff. So I got everything out and I've been using it and I've had so much fun. So as always, I try to save as much of this paper as I can because I use it. I wonder if I can get that little stamp off. Uh, okay, don't be extra like I'm trying to be. Oh my goodness, y'all, this is always so much fun. I cannot tell you how much I enjoy doing this. So let's just get right to it. The first little thing I see, and I love these, and there's always something like this in the boxes. So it says Retro Library Series, and it looks like there's 50. And these are so cute. These are little stickers. And so these look like old postcards. These are great for layering. Oh my goodness, look how cute these are. These are just adorable. Look at that. Love that. Ooh, Purple Dawn Original Matchbox Material Paper. Huh. I love this box, number one. Love that box. And it looks like, I don't know how many pieces. Oh, wow. These are pretty. Look at that. And these are not stickers. They're just very good quality card stock. And it looks like three of each design. I don't know if it'll show up on camera. They're kind of embossed. I don't know if you guys can see that. They're beautiful. Please tell me what's on your mind. That is so, I love that material. That texture, oh, they're in their embossed filling. Oh, these are so pretty. <gasps> Look at that one, wow. Oh, I wish that would show up on camera. Can you guys see it? The white is raised. Man, that's pretty. Wow. It's almost like a uh, handmade paper texture. And then all of these elements feel to be like they're embossed on it. Oh, look at that. These are just so pretty. Y'all know I normally don't go through them, each of them one by one like this, but I cannot help it. 
Oh, that's so beautiful. I think this is one of my favorite things I've ever received in the kits. And y'all know I have a bunch of favorites. Ah, oh, that is so pretty. This is just gorgeous. And that's pretty. So you get a bunch of these in there. And I don't want to use them, but I need to use them. I can already feel that I'm going to try and hoard these, but I don't need to do that. I need to use them. So I'm going to try. I'm going to attempt to use them, even though I honestly want to hoard them because these are beautiful. I mean, literally, this is some of the prettiest, like, labels, tags, whatever you want to call it, that I've received. Those are just, and then that box. The box should have been a good indicator that they were going to be beautiful. All right, and then this is Worn Pages. Y'all, and look, I'm throwing the plastic away so that that way I don't try to hold on to it and hoard it. And so these, um, these come a lot of times in the different kits. And so it's like different types of paper that is great for collaging. Oh, these are so pretty. Look at that. Oh, that one's beautiful. And so um, it'll have like the white paper. And then in the back, it's like on craft paper. Look how pretty that is. That is just beautiful. Wow, love it. Okay, oh, I need to get something to stamp on. Cling stamp. Y'all know I love these. I love the stamps. And I'm going to try and open that up. Do I have anything right here? Look how pretty that is. That is beautiful. Well, let's just stamp it on the back of here. Do I have some ink right here? I have some of my vintage photo because that's what I'm working with right now. So that's what we will go with. Simply because all of my other inks are in the cabinet where they're supposed to be. Imagine that. So I don't know how good I'm going to get this stamped because I am just playing but we're going to try all of these stamp every time I've done them they've always stamped so beautifully let's see and if it don't stamp good I'll get a different I'll just reach over and grab a different ink oh that's pretty let me grab a different ink so that we can actually see it it's just right here in the drawer. Uh, which drawer is it in? Nope. All right. Get my stays on. And I'll tell you what we'll do. We will stamp this right into my collage book. Let's do that. Let's see how it looks. So we'll just go to a page. Let me go to a page that I haven't. Some of these I've put like um, a Mod Podge type stuff on and some of them I haven't. So I just went to one of the blank pages. And this ink pad is good and juicy. My, uh, my vintage photo, I think it needs re-inking. All right, so let me put the lid on that so I don't stick my hand all in it. And let's just put it right there. Let's see what it looks like. Oh my goodness. Can you guys see that? Isn't that beautiful? Wow, I love that. I love that. Okay, very excited about that. That is so pretty. So there's that. And then, oh, here's another clean stamp. I might can just tear this one off. Yep. Let's 
see what this one is. Oh, this is a cup. That's a couple of stamps. All right, so let's see what these are. Did I get the little plastic off of that one? I must have. Throw that away. All right, let's stamp down on this. These don't ever stick onto the things for me, though, which is fine. Sometimes I'll stick it onto that and it sticks, but it ain't doing it tonight. All right, let's stamp it onto this as well. Just right onto my collage master board. Ah! And all over my clothes. But it's a good thing I have a black dress on. Y'all know I'm always making messes. All right, let's stick this one like right there. Oh, this is so pretty. Y'all ready? <sighs> wow, look, guys. Isn't that gorgeous? Goodness gracious, that's pretty. Just getting any extra ink off of that. Love that. Let's see what this little one is. I think I got it inked up. Let's put that right there. Oh my goodness, that is adorable. I may use some of these in my new journal that I'm making right here. I don't know. Look at that. Man, these stamps are beautiful. I love them. Love, 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 love those. Look how pretty those are, guys. Look at that. Can y'all see how clear they stamped out? Just beautiful. All right, so there's those. This is, it says masking tape, so it's a washi tape. And let's get this one opened. Oh, that's beautiful too. You know what? We're going to just put a strip right here in onto the collage master board. Look at that. Let's see. Where do we want to put it? Right there looks good. Look how pretty that is. Can you guys see that? That is just beautiful. Love it. Okay, that is, oh, I can't wait to use that. I actually am going to use that stuff. All right, so this is some more of like that collage type paper. And let's take a look at it. Ooh. All right, so we've got some squares. That one's a vellum. Oh my goodness. So it looks like it's a regular piece of paper and then a vellum of, oh my goodness. That is too pretty. Oh, wow. Oh yes, I will be using these. Uh, do not hoard Betty Renfro, do not hoard, do not hoard. Ah, uh, I want a hoard. These are just gorgeous. Look at that. And it's several different sizes. I love that one. So you see it's the vellum and then like the regular paper. Man, these are beautiful. I love these. Look at that. That's so pretty. Okay, do not hoard, do not hoard, do not hoard. Do not hoard. Ugh, I wanna hoard. I really do wanna hoard these. I'm not going to, I don't think, I don't know. I may end up hoarding them. Ugh. These are going back in the pack. <laughs> Which means I may end up hoarding them. I'm gonna try not to. I'm really going to try not to. Okay. 
What is this? Guys, this is so pretty. All right, so these, are, oh. Oh my goodness, these are beautiful. These are beautiful. Look at that. With, is that a rose gold accent? So it looks like you get three of each. Man, those are pretty. We're going to, so they're like stamps is what they're supposed to look like. We got to put one of these down and let's do it. Mm, which one do we want to put down? Let's take a look. I think I want to put, I don't know. I want to put this one down. All right. Let's just put it down in the little, onto the collage master board. Right there like that. Oh, that's so pretty. Look at that. I love it. Oh, I will definitely be using these. Those are so pretty, and I love the little envelope that they're in, because I will be using the envelope, too. Yep. After I use all the stamps, which might not take a while, because I, I can feel myself wanting to hoard those as well. All right. The next thing is this little sheet of it. It's like um, washi sticker type um, stamps. And so we're going to go ahead and stick one down here. Look how pretty that is. It's just beautiful. And so it's a sheet of those. It uh, looks like two different sizes. And what is this? This is a textured paper. Oh, no, I think this is stickers. I think it is. <sighs> no way. Y'all, that's stickers. That is too cool. So it look, if you look on the back, you can kind of see. So it looks like there may be like some stamps. Is that a leaf or something right here? Look at that. Wow. Guys, that almost feels like an art canvas. I don't know if the texture is picking up on screen. That is beautiful. All right, and then we have paper ephemera. And so these are like journal cards and they're so thick. These are just perfect. So it looks like you get two of each one and these are gorgeous. Mm, these are so pretty. Now I'm wishing I had purples in that journal I'm doing is more neutral, but I'm I'm wondering if I can incorporate these colors into it somehow because these are just so pretty. Oh, look at that. Oh, that one's pretty. Look at that one. Oh, now I love that one. Ooh. I'm, I'm wondering, can I somehow incorporate these colors into this journal? I think I can. Hmm. Y'all may be seeing these very shortly. These are just so pretty. Ugh. I love those. Love, 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 love those. I'm going to have to, I think I'm going to have to somehow figure out how to incorporate these colors into this journal I'm working on. All right. And then this is, how do I open this thing? I know it's like a little matchbook type thing, but I don't, I don't want to tear nothing up. I think this, I guess it, I don't want to tear it up. 
I guess it's stuck down and you have to like unstick it, but I don't want to tear it up. Alright, we're just going to, I don't know how to get into it. Be smarter than me, guys. This is what happens when you want to get into it so bad. You know what I'm fixing to do? Because I want to get into this. I want to see it. Let's kill. Oh, duh. Look. See? There you go, guys. Don't do as I do. Do as I say. So these are also like a washi type strip. Ooh. It's just all sorts of different designs. Oh, look at that. All right. Let's put one down. Let's see. I'm going to go right on the same paper right here. And we're just going to put it right there. Oh, I love it. Love, love, love it. And that's pretty. Okay. So don't do like I do. There's actually a way to open it. And then I love getting these in this pack. So um, these are pretty, I think these always come in it. So, and it contains 24 sheets. So it's six sheets of sticker paper, six vellum, six art, and six pattern. And these are always so pretty. But these right here are just gorgeous. All right. Let's take a look at it. I've got to figure out how to incorporate this into the journal or else I'm just going to have to make another journal. This, guys, is just so pretty. This is the sticker paper that I'm looking at right here. Ugh. Look at that. Look at that. Wow. Oh, I love this one. I mean, I love that one. I think is my favorite. And then this is like the... Um, I think this is the pat the which one is that? I think this is the art paper. It's like textured. Oh, that's so pretty. Just so beautiful. So pretty. And then this is the six pattern paper. And I love how smooth that is. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, and then you get your vellum. Look at that. Oh, that, look at that one. I love these. Uh, okay, guys. I will be using this kit um, probably sooner rather than later. Because if I am not able to incorporate these colors into the journal that I'm currently doing, I am going to do a journal as soon as I finish this one. And I will be using this kit because I can just, I'm already envisioning it right now. So if you have not already went over there, what are you waiting for? Go, go and grab you one of these boxes. Um, I will have the website linked in the description below. Um, I know they have Instagram as well. Guys, you've got to get one of these kits, or like I said, two or three of them. It's just it's beautiful. It is just stunning. Stunning. So let me know what you guys think of this. Let me know what your favorite um, is in this pack. I would love to know that. Um, my favorite, let me see. What is my favorite in this pack? I'm just trying to look. Hmm. Let me just see. I 
thinking. Um, I love those, but I don't think they're my favorite. These are running a real close. I mean, these right here are definitely, these are beautiful. And I, mm, those may be, um, these are beautiful too. So I don't know. Oh, I know what my favorite is. Let me get this stuff out where we can. My favorite are these things right here. Let me just get this out. I'm just trying to get it to where you guys can kind of see what all is in this kit. These are my favorite. Yep. Absolutely. These are my, my favorite. I think these are my number one favorite. Then I'd have to say these are my number two favorite in this kit. So, yeah, there you go, guys. Look at all these, this yummy goodness. Ugh. I cannot wait to start playing with this. And I've got to figure out how to incorporate this into the journal that I'm doing right now. Because I really want to go ahead and play with it. But I need to get that journal finished if this doesn't go in it. Ugh. Yeah, so there you go, guys. Let me know what y'all think. Tell me which one is your favorite. You know, I'm not going to be biased and tell you which your favorite should be. But, just let me know what your favorite is. <laughs> I'll talk to you later, guys. Bye.